Thank you, Jackie. It's relatively quiet again tonight in the Chautauqua County town of Portland, but some neighbors were out tonight checking out the damage from yesterday's now confirmed EF1 tornado. Channel 2's Ron Plant spoke tonight with one man who watched it all happen from his home, which he thought was right in the path of the twister. We're just seeing it just just going this way, just spinning around. And uh, as fast as it came, it left. That's John Kane's close encounter with a force of nature which ripped through farm properties along Barnes Road just before 5 o'clock Thursday evening, leaving this path of destruction. It first smashed his neighbor's barn, obliterating that structure and leaving torn metal in its wake in a nearby field. John worried about them in the nearby house. She was in the house with her two-year-old son. The house didn't get touched on them either. All it was was the barn. Then it started its diagonal course right towards John. My wife and I were both looking out the window, which we probably shouldn't have been, but we were, and we saw it hit the farm down the road and then come across the road, and then it was heading straight for us, and we were watching as it was just spinning 10 yards away from the house, and we watched it just take the roof off the barn, board by board and, and the metal by metal, and we... We, we thought it was going to take the whole roof, but all of a sudden it didn't. And then off to the northeast it went. And we could see things flying around inside of it, but it wasn't on the ground when it got to us. It was, it was up, which is why it only took the roof. We walked the foundation of the barn this morning. It actually twisted the whole barn slightly off the foundation, cracking cinder blocks, and so it's not repairable. It's just not repairable. But it's the barn, not the house. It's not the house. And <laughs> there we, you go. We, we only lost a shingle on the house. That was it. And this evening, as people looked on and reflected on the fact that no one was hurt, this neighborly note. You know, it's heartbreaking, but yet knowing the, the kind of people that are here, I know that the neighbors, their friends, their relatives, uh, maybe even people that aren't Amish will be here um, helping them get their lives back together. Ron Plants, Channel 2 News. Wow, thank you, Ron. With storms like these, you yourself can help us tell the story. And we have added a new feature to our mobile app to make it even easier. It's called Near Me. It's a way to share your photos, especially of storm damage, that show everyone where they were taken by showing a map view. All you have to do is open up our app, click Near Me in the bottom right corner, then hit Share with us, to send your pictures or videos.